protection to the kidney. And one thing I want you to be able to do is to distinguish on the slides of those on the bottles the cortex from the middle. And the cortex, and only the cortex, has these structures, which are renal corpuscles. They're confined to the cortex. That's what gives the cortex a granular appearance. For instance, these spherical structures called renal corpuscles. And they consist of two components. This network of capillaries here, which is called the glomerulus or glomerular capillaries. And the reflecting table around it, you can see part of the cavity of that, which is called the Bowman's capsule or glomerular capsule. The other renal corpuscle. And again, they're confined to the cortex. So if you look at the slide, you see these structures, you know you're in the cortex, not in the dome. Now, most of the renal tubule consists of simple cuboid epithelium, the wall, simple cuboid epithelium. But there are some exceptions. I'd like you to note those. The first one you see right here. Here we have, again, particle areas of the capillaries. Here's the wall of the Bowman's capsule, or the regular capsule. It is lined with simple nucleus, <coughs> dedicated by the single layer of fat nuclei, as opposed to most of the rest of the tubule, which is simple cuboidal, shown here by the spherical or brown nuclei. And this, of course, is a little possible on the tubule coming out of the Bowman's capsule. Yeah, this is the Marius or the Lander capillaries. This is the Bowman's capsule. Here's the cavity of it. Again, it's lined with simple squamous epithelium. You can also see it in the models. And here is the possible common tubule coming out of Bowman's capsule. Now, most of the sections you're going to see are cross sections in the kidney. I'm not going to ask you to differentiate on the slides between proximal and distal common tubules there. So, in something like this, I think it's pretty obvious it's a proximal common tubule. I think it's fair game to ask that. Now you've got, other than blood vessels, you have three types of tubes <coughs> in the cortex. One, of course, the proximal common tubule. What are the other two? I'm talking about blood vessels. What other parts of the real tubule or tubes would you see in the cortex? Distal common tubules, proximal common tubules. Or what else? Something that's not, it's a tube, but it's not part of the nephron. What would that be? What's a distal common tubule? Empty into it. Maybe two million halves. Collecting duct. Okay? So, if you're asked what parts of the nephron, what tubes of the nephron, other than blood vessels, okay, that would be part of the nephron anyway, uh, what tubes of the nephron would you see in the cortex? Your answer would be what? Proximal common tubules, distal common tubules. Okay? If you ask what tubes other than blood vessels would you see in the cortex, what would your answer be? Collecting duct. Say again. I said, what tubes would you expect to see in the cortex other than blood vessels? In the cortex, renal corpuscles, the capillaries, both capsule, proximal tubule, 